The Adventures of Gilligan's Island, Bandai, 1990. So in the beginning we see all the characters from the show, and it opens with ridiculous dialogue and sets the scene for Skipper and Gilligan. You take control of Skipper here, and Gilligan just falls you around, so I guess you need to keep him with you somehow. If you happen to lose Gilligan at some point, you can use a rope, and it just pulls him back automatically from wherever he disappeared to. So the rope brings back Gilligan, food restores your health obviously, and the map just gives you this simplistic looking map of the area. So I'm not sure where I'm supposed to go, so I assume I'm supposed to go to this H since it's the only thing marked on the map. So we get there and this stuck up bitch says she won't talk to Hal until he finds his ring. So I guess we're off to find it. So after looking around a little more, I found the professor, I found Marianne, but neither of them were any help. Gilligan fell down the hole. Even AI on the NES suck. So I've been to every corner of this visible map, I've not found the ring anywhere. Including this corner here with this big ass gorilla. Maybe you gotta get it from him somehow. But the only attack you have in this game is this punch that makes you look like Wreck-It Ralph. So, I can't find the ring. I don't understand what you're supposed to do. I'm bored already. I never played this game as a kid. I'm sure I've probably been just as bored with it then as I am now. It's really hard to justify almost anything about this game. I can only assume they were just trying to cash in on the popularity of the show, but by the time this game came out, the show was canceled. 23 years earlier. I didn't really get into the show, and I didn't really get into this game much, so I'll just give it a 2 out of 10. Mm -hmm.